All right, electors, that is six votes certified for President Donald J. Trump. This event, posing as an official ceremony, is central to the indictments announced today in Nevada. A grand jury indicted these six fake electors. They now face felony charges. Donald J. Trump of the state of Florida, having received six electoral votes, uh, is declared the um, winner of the electoral votes for the state of Nevada. That's a lie. Trump lost Nevada in 2020 by 33,000 votes. Joe Biden won Nevada's six electoral votes. The document they signed that day became part of a charade seeking to undermine voters' faith in democracy. Since that day in 2020, the fake electors have faced scrutiny, but they did not face charges until today and have continued in Republican politics. We found two of them in this Reno, Nevada library. You haven't spoken it. You're not yeah, going to comment on whether you've spoken to anybody. On that's going on, right? Uh, but so, you do understand I, it's a. Please, it's a, if you would turn that off, we have nothing to talk about really on that. Yeah, I have nothing to say. This is Nevada Republican Vice Chairman Jim Hindle now indicted, and Nevada Republican Party National Committeeman Jim DeGraffenreid also indicted. Yeah, have I don't you have been any, don't contacted have any, by investigators on that? What about the testimony oh, in Georgia? The don't have case any comment on that. We've been making the roadshow around uh, the, the state. Chris crossing the state, talking about next year's caucus. Is there any no. irony in you <laughs> going around with, as you, uh, to use your words, the roadshow, talking about 2024 when in 2020 I, you signed this I'm fake elector document? I'm questions. I apologize, but you, you know, I'm, this is not something I will entertain. Do you still believe you. Trump won? Yeah, it's irrelevant. Um, the Electoral College elects the president, and so the Electoral College elected Joe Biden, and so Joe Biden is the president. But how do you explain what happened in 2020, that ceremony you participated in and the document you signed? Again, no comment on that. We contacted all of Nevada's six fake electors about the state attorney general's investigation. I'm looking for Sean Meehan. This is him. And this is Meehan in 2020. Sean Meehan. President in the attorney general's investigation of the fake electors. I have no comment on that. Let's try it so. You've reached the office of Michael J. McDonald. I'm trying to reach Mr. McDonald again. The leader of the fake electors, Michael McDonald. Current Nevada Republican chairman was center stage just last month. Trump! Trump! One of Trump's closest allies in the West. I want to thank Michael. He's been fantastic right from the beginning. McDonald has been summoned by both the January 6th grand jury and in the Georgia fake electors case. McDonald is also now indicted. 